While several factors have been attributed as largely responsible for the peaceful conduct of the adult state governorship election, including the peace signing accord, it is only expedient that such gesture should be extended to a Ndo state governorship poll. The candidates courting across different political parties include Roti Miyakere Dulu of the All Progressive Congress APC, Ejitayo Jegede of the People's Democratic Party PDP, and Agbola Ajayi, who is contesting on the platform of Zenith Labour Party ZLP. The peace accord signing was facilitated by the National Peace Committee. And speaking for myself on this, I am absolutely, absolutely committed to a peaceful election. Ondo State and the Southwest is very strategic. In our previous democratic experience, where we have republics falling, that's always started from here. And what engineer did was violence and lack of free and fair election. We all have a date with history, today and thereafter, and we'll be judged by what we do now by the generations that are yet on board. With all the eminent people who are here today, we have given a pledge. We will continue to talk to our people. But immediately, we are on Thursday, the last day for campaign, I can assure you, everybody will go back and sit in his own place, wait for Saturday to vote. And because then, billboard, posters, the vehicles are no longer relevant. I won't be on campaign anyway, so you won't see me, I won't see you. It's just to mobilize people to go and vote. So I want to thank you. I can assure you that Saturday, by the grace of the Almighty God, that we trust in that the election will be free and fair. In his address, the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakub, emphasized the importance of peaceful environment and the conduct of election. Without peace, our deployment plans, new innovations in results management, the safety of personnel, security of materials, and above all, the credibility of the elections will be severely undermined. Even worse, public health will be jeopardized as observance of safety protocols in the context of the COVID-19 pandemic will be impossible to achieve in an atmosphere of disruption, violence, and disorder. At Saturday poll approaches, the candidates and their supporters are advised and encouraged to follow the path of peace in their hot races and actions. Welcome back. It's to Plus Politics, and we're moving straight to the second topic of the day. A field in Southwest People's Democratic Party involving the Oyo State Governor, Shei Makinde, and former Governor of Ekiti State, Ayodele Fayoshe, has been said to be brewing. In view of this, the aides of the two camps engaged in a war of words a few, uh, I mean, let me say some, some days ago. Yesterday, we heard from the spokesperson of the former Ekiti State Governor, and uh, that's Mr. Lirio Lainka. And today, we'll hear from Jackson Adebayo, who is the former Publicity Secretary of Ekiti State PDP on this issue. Good evening, Mr. Adebayo. Yeah, good evening. Yeah, good to have you. Uh, yeah, thank you very much. I hope we have the ample time to listen to Mr. Lirio Lainka. I think I did. Okay, good. Let's get the conversation started. I recall that um, this issue of a likely uh, field that we are interpreting now started from your camp when I, 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 we have that report on our channel where Senator Lujimi was saying that the leader of Southwest PDP is Governor Sheyima Kinde and not Governor Fayoshe, who probably was going to the national, to the NWC, and people would say, what was wrong in visiting the national? What was wrong as a former governor and as a chief trainer of PDP visiting that party? Why was there an issue from your camp? It, there is no controversy about the situation and on the leadership of the party in the Southwest. The reason being that uh, the highest po uh, political uh, office holder in a particular sector or section of the party naturally becomes the leader of the party. 
And that was why when we had Governor Farouche as the governor of the state, as at then, he was the only one that was the governor produced by PDP in the old Southwest. And everybody in the Southwest believed and gave him the respect as the leader of the party. If at the twist of the ten when uh, Governor Mimi Popo in those states who decant from Labour Party to join PDP, he still submitted himself to the leadership of Governor Payos as a then, because he, he was coming from another party and he met uh, Payos as the main product of PDP. And that conferred the leadership of the party in the Southwest on Governor Fires today. Okay. Vito, what is happening today, the only governor that is produced by the PDP in the Southwest, Governor Shehima today of Ohio State. Okay. So naturally, without any controversy, is the leader of the party in the Southwest. And nobody can contest that. And that one is recognized both nationally and internationally. Okay. Of what have you that you call it? Okay, Jackson, so, uh, I need a bit of clarity here. Uh, one, it is on record that Liri Olainka uh, didn't also disagree with you that um, he is the only elected governor of the state, I mean, of, of the region. But please, I'm not a member of PDP, but I think I'm aware that uh, your constitution hasn't said that. So you use the word naturally. What yeah. about the constitution? Does your constitution support that? Thank you very that? much. Thank okay. you very much. Uh, when, you are talking about the, when you are talking about the constitution of the party, there is no way that is stated that uh, this is uh, uh, who is going to be the leader or who is not going to be the leader. Constitutionally, the chairman of the party becomes the leader of the party in every state. But by convention, which is even globally accepted, you know, even in UK, they don't use constitution, they use convention. By convention, the president produced by the party is the leader of the party. Mm -hmm. The governor that is produced by the party is the leader of the party in the state. Ditto other factor, you know, of the party. So for somebody to be talking about constitution when it comes to leadership of the party, when all of us know, unless it is only a mischievous person that will not will say, or oh, somebody that is ailing to uh, uh, or strange to PDP tradition, is the only person that will say that uh, there's no way in the constitution. We are, we are talking about convention this time around. We are talking about tradition. We are talking about practice. Okay. We are talking about uh, 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 composition. Okay. Let's let's That's quickly. What we are talking about. Let's... When 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 when, when yeah, yeah, Shifo Basanjo was the president of the party, who can contend the leadership with him? Interesting. Even when Governor Fauci was the governor of the party in the southwest, who can contend the leadership? With him? Okay, Jackson, I I I'm not arguing with you, but I think the two scenarios are different. It wasn't just the leader of the party; it was actually elected the governor in the PDP governors forum, right? That's talking about... No, no, don't mix up this thing. Don't mix it up. Okay, let me mix it well. The, 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 the chairmanship of the governor, of, of PDP governor's forum is different from what we are talking about. It is not limited to only a state. Okay. Thank it you for that clarity. Here. Thank you for that clarity. Let's come back to your state now. Um, Senator Lujimi's name is propping up, and I understand that... Uh, you are a strong loyalist of that camp. And some, according to uh, Larry, he, he also reminded us that this was a product of Governor Fayoshi, former Governor Fayoshi, that this was an essay from essay to commissioner, from commissioner to deputy governor. And why should he, why should she in any way, you know, disrespect him as the leader of the party in the state? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Who is disrespecting who? Has he forgotten to tell you that it was same Governor Fayoshi that campaigned against Senator Yoru Lijimi when he was contesting for the Senate? 
It was the same governor policy that went on air, went on TV, went on everywhere, on newspaper, newspaper, saying that they should not vote for a party a, 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 his own party member and the candidate of the party, he, who was the senator uh, Bielorugi needed, before he was vindicated at the tribunal. As if I'm going to say that a person that is playing anti party activities, a person that is just like somebody that is saying that those okay, plus TV will be bombed. <laughs> you, I think you will be portrayed for the person. That is, that is a strong analogy. <laughs> that means I know that, that's it. You will be portrayed for, for the person. But, but is, is that, one, is, is that, that where the problem you. started? No, no, no. Let me now tell you the genesis of the whole Exactly. Something. When he's saying that uh, he, made him, he made that this, he made that that, who made Governor Powell say the governor? Please tell I me. I will tell you what some of them don't want us to be saying. I will say it now. In the first instance, when Governor Powell say was looking for this ticket before 2010, it was the same senator Jim who introduced him to Baba Oloye, that's uh, uh, Dr. Michelle Sarati. It was only Solar Sarati that lifted Pauls up, that introduced him to all the power that be, and that was how he got his own ticket. He will not tell you this. That is one. Two, can somebody become a governor without the contribution of other members of the party? So are we saying that uh, when, once you become the governor, you have become God? You will only be governor, you can't be commissioner, you can't be senator, you can't be rep at the same time. Some other people will occupy this position. That's why they join and in order to make you the governor. So for nobody is it just a, a political party position is a product of collaboration. It's not something that is that. Okay. If if I get your logic properly, I, I seek to, more clarity on that. If I got your logic properly. Now somebody made fire or shape. But do you disagree that fire or shape made Olujimi? And why sh and uh, as we speak, as fire or shape also beating the finger that you know that fed him, and why yes. should we have that? Yes, that's what actually happened. How? I've told you somebody introduced you <coughs> and brought you into a limelight. And that somebody was Senator Olujimi. To a place where you are connected to achieve your own ambition. Wouldn't you reciprocate? Now, that, that, one, that one apart. Now, by the time you wanted to become the governor the second time, it was the same senator Jimmy that was running around for you to make sure that all the. Because he had left the party, he was in the Labour Party, Labour party. he was in one party or the other. Then he was coming down to the party. It was same Senator Olujimi and other people that were running around to make sure that he's acceptable to be accepted by the leadership of PDP. Now, when you are accepted by the leadership of the PDP, you say you want to become governor, you want to become senator again. So those people who run around you will not become any other thing again. Are you the one that will now give it to them? Now, now let's let's look at the way forward. Um, as much as I'm not a member of your party, what's the way forward? You know the implication of having factions. You know the implication of having two different camps within the <laughs> state. So yeah. we should bow to who, and what's the way forward? What will you prefer? Well, uh, my, the way forward is for everybody to be sincere with the party. Let everybody come to the round table. All of us who are stakeholders in the party. Nobody owns the party. The party is a family affair. And when there is a quarrel or whatever misunderstanding within the family, you have to come around that together. Then you discuss the problem. You remove the log in the whole something. Then you come together, then you forge ahead. But not in the face of injustice and the lack of fairness. There must be justice. Whoever that is coming, I mean, that, 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 that is coming for EQT must come with a very clean hand. So but, you can't come to the round table with an opinion that I want to lord this over these people. You must surrender your ego 
all members, all the stakeholders, all graduators, they must surrender their ego and put everything on the table. And that is how things will be settled amicably. Okay, in fairness to... In fairness yes. to uh, 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 former Governor Fauci's uh, media aim, that's uh, Lero Lainka, he did say that um, there seems to be no issue between the former governor and his former deputy, that's uh, Senator Olujimi, that what the issue is, is, is Governor Makini that is fueling the crisis, is taking sides. How, uh, is, yeah, how is Governor Makini fueling the crisis? What is the concern of Governor Makini here? Is that they are only trying to dodge uh, they are nefarious activities and blame it upon another person that is outside the How do you mean nefarious? That's a very yes, strong I word. I mean nefarious in the sense, is it, in the sense, the process, in the, when we were holding the Congress, our Congress in March, uh, March 7th, uh, they knew what they did. They knew the manipulation they did. Was it Martin that did the, man, the manipulation? So why should they blame my Martin Day? Please, you have we, to be... Because, like because, of the, because of the viewing Martin. public, can you be clearer? What is the manipulation? What exactly did they do? They, 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 during the Congress, they went, they cornered the, 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 uh, the people that are coming from Abuja. Just like when a kidnapper ran off some people and they put them in an hotel and they started writing figures. They did not participate in any Congress. They started writing names, the teachers' names. And they submitted it to Abuja. And as we speak. And we, we that are members of the party, we had the Congress who were on the speech. And they, 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 made, they made sure that they didn't uh, allow the resource of the Congress to materialize. Then what are you talking about? So as we speak, which. Uh... Which body is recognized by the national? There is no body that is recognized by the national. There is no body because all the things that you have done are inconclusive. Hmm. They are inconclusive. And that is why we are in court. That's a very serious for, issue. For us to now declare us, I mean, to tell, to tell the national to conclude the Congress. Okay. So as we are with the Congress, your, 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 your prescription is that everybody should bury their ego and come together, yeah. right? Yes. And, yes. How, and how, willing are you, how willing is your camp to that? How willing? Yes. We are, we, 80% of members of PDP in the United States are in our camp. Wow. And a lawyer party member who always wants his party to win election. Okay. And to win election, you can't do it in the divided house. So the, que the question of willingness does not arise. Okay. Anybody that is not willing now, that, that person is an enemy of the party. Wow. Thank you so it's much. An enemy it's, of the party. Unless, the, you know, we have some people, they are just in politics because of what they, they, what they need. We are not in politics because of... Okay, thank you, party. Jackson. They don't, they don't love the party. Jackson, our, our time is up day. now. We, we may not be able to continue this conversation. Your thoughts are well noted, and I'm sure the other camp is listening to you. And I can only advise the two camps to jaw jaw rather than war war. Thank you for your time. Jackson Adebayo, former Publicity Secretary of AKT State, PDP. Thank you very much. And to our viewers, thank you for staying with us. We'll take a short break now. And when we return, I'll be giving you my take. Please don't go anywhere. Here is my take. Fair enough, there will be a lot of comparison between the September 19 Edo State governorship election and the upcoming election in Ondo State to the great people of Sunshine State. What do you want your electoral legacy to be for the next four years? The ball is in your court. To the Electoral Commission, consistency is the rule of the game. We look forward to high-level transparency and fairness of the process. Let's have the voting materials arrive early, better implementation of INEC result viewing portal, where the people can compute results simultaneously while waiting for the official declaration, 
And as regards the tension in Southwest PDP, I think it's time to resort to the constitution of the party to settle the issue the party has. It might be a waste of time to advise against betrayal and monslinging, but it is not out of place to counsel against slander and defamation of character. The game of politics can be played on differences of ideologies and principles. That I 100% subscribe to. And that is my take on today's edition of Plus Politics. Plus Politics returns tomorrow, same time, on the same station. I remain yours truly, Coyote Ladeini, saying bye for now.